<laughs> well, look who's back. This content is intended for ages 13 plus only. If you are younger than 13, please do not watch this content. It is 5.45 in the morning. I'm up early, but it is well worth it. YouTube, what's good? What's happening? Hope everybody's having a great day. Hope you're staying safe out there this morning only. Dita Toys on here bringing you the latest and greatest in wrestling figure collecting. <sighs> Feels good to be back once again. New shave, new haircut. But more importantly, it is con day. 2023 Nashville Comic Con today. I'm so excited. As you can see, the new fig drip. Yeah! It's coming soon to the to the store, so make sure you watch out for that. But getting ready to meet up with a couple of the homies, of course, old man pops and the homie Alex. I'm actually waiting on the homie Alex right now. And uh we're gonna meet up with old man pops and we're gonna jump on the road. It's gonna be a good day today. Definitely gonna be a good day today. But I gotta show y'all something. This uh, Series 89 Sergeant Slaughter is the mission for today because we have got to get this sign. Because Sergeant Slaughter is supposed to be at the con as well as uh, Chuck Norris. So hopefully we'll be getting some autographs today, be getting some pictures. And of course, you know we're going to look for some wrestling figures. If they're priced correctly. <laughs> but um, yeah, definitely going to be a fun time. Definitely going to be a good day. Uh, go grab your popcorn. Go get your favorite beverage because this is going to be an epic day. It's going to be a good day. And if you're new to the channel and you like what you see, you love wrestling figure collecting, super kick that subscribe button. Be sure to like, comment, and share. And I will see y'all at the con. Before we go to step foot in the con, we had to stop at a Target because old man Pops had to use the bathroom. <laughs> 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 All right, we got some. I think stuff that's been at every other Target. There's the bat wing that everybody's going nuts over. <laughs> you feel better? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Yondu, Emma Frost, Ultimate Cap. Oh, all right. That is the common Andre. There's a uh, Hulk Hogan, Ken Shamrock. Okay. It's good to see y'all. Uh, here's the new top picks. Bobby Lashley. There's uh, Shazam down there at the bottom. Bullseye. Top picks. So really, not too much, but it's good to see Series 100. That's some. About to say it, five. Bruh. <laughs> You're like you haven't been breathing for the last 30 minutes. <laughs> Yeah, you 
So, really? Well, since there's... Here's some... Across the Spider-Verse stuff. But really, not too much of this Target. Uh, we'll take a look at the NECA Funko section and we'll go from there. All right, here we are at the NECA Funko section and the section is pretty clean. Um, usually a lot of older stuff. I've got the Gremlins 2 new batch, Greta, which that looks scary. I do not remember Two-Face in Batman 66, but we'll go with it. Logan Andre. Yeah, that's everywhere now. And just from a Funko perspective, it don't look like there's anything. Got some Playmates. Uh, Star Trek figures. There's that. So, all in all, not too bad. Let's find dynamite. Not a whole lot. Some black light one division. I showed it to Trina. <laughs> Bruh. Why you got the notches on throat? I never know he's gonna buy him, but still, come on. Did, what come the on. hell? But that's it for this neck of Funko section and uh We'll see y'all at the car. We're getting the VIP treat, man. We're going straight to the front. So. Yeah, I think, yeah, yeah it looked like they started two lines. So. We're good. We're good. Not much. All right. We are at. We finally done made it in. We in the car and we in here. We gonna walk around for a little bit, see what's, see what's in here and hopefully we can get this bad boy signed. So, uh, I'll walk around for a little bit, see what they got and I be, I'll get back with y'all. Art. Nothing, nothing says joy like some good art. My bad. <laughs> yeah. But it's dope as shit, though. Blacklight art. That's dope. We found... This booth right here. Yeah. Got a tub full of AEW figures that I have. Got some Lucy Gooses, Masha Thrasher, the Headbangers. Merlin. That's some pretty cool stuff here at this booth right here. Sam, I'm gonna hang up the phone. Oh wow. Wow. <laughs> Hadn't seen these in ages. Got some Funkos right here. Uh oh. 
<laughs> Are you tempted? I don't know. <laughs> OG Genesis Games. Mm -hmm. AEW in the corner. Yeah. Not too bad. Not pretty cool booth right here. Stuff I haven't seen since I got out of the Marvel Legend game. Did you hear the price of my legs? Yeah, 300. Yeah. He can keep it. He ah, can keep ah. it. First time I've seen this up close in person. This is the Alpha Flight six pack. Very, very dope. How much? Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> A pretty decent booth right here. Yeah, I knew this was out because I seen this in uh, what's the name video? Oh, cool. Yellow. Yeah, it's and in the, the singlet. Uh, Brian Myers. The wrestling ones, those are the companies called Super Seven that put them out, but we're doing them at fifty-five each. Okay, that's actually not bad. And the the thing that's bad is on this one you can't even see it, but the the sleeve that goes over it is super cool too. So depending on how you display things, because this is the stripper box that you get with it too. But look at that's pretty cool too. Or it's about yeah. I think yeah, that. Uh, yeah, it's definitely possible. Autograph secured from the one and only Sergeant Slaughter. It was a joy to meet. I actually had to got a few minutes with him to talk uh, wrestling, and he's like one of the, the nicest guys ever. So, huge shout out to Sergeant Slaughter. And uh, yeah, this. I'm, I'm a kid now. Kid in the candy store. I'm kid in the candy store, man. Like we're gonna walk around a little bit more. I think I'm done spending money here because I literally I just spent a hundred dollars just. Did you kids just I think so. <laughs> but uh, that was fun. That was a lot of fun. But uh. I think we're going to walk around the con a little bit more. Uh, see if we can find some more stuff. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. And, uh, yeah. I don't know. I talked to him about Boy Meets World for a minute. <laughs> Got a signature. Real Sweet. Nice guy. Did the Feeny, Feeny call for me. Feeny! <laughs> 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 but yeah man we're just we're having a blast here i even got the cobra clutch put on me that was awesome <laughs> but, uh, yeah i'll post the pictures at the at i'm actually gonna post uh pictures on my uh my ig story as i'm going through the day but um, yeah, it's already been a crazy day, and like I said, I've already shelled out a hundred bucks, and that was just a meat sergeant slaughter. So, like I say, I think I'm done spending at the con. But I'm gonna walk around a little bit more. Uh, if I see any more cool stuff, I will let you know. All right, here we are at another booth. What, what you got, Alex? Uh, Yuji from uh, Jujutsu Kaisen. Okay. Um, the first vessel of Sukuna. I'll pick it up. 
I might. I might. <laughs> Alright, here we are in the Marvel Corner, right here. A lot of the stuff I already have, even though I am out of the Funko game. First time seeing actual Freddy Funkos up close in person. Man, they're cool. Not for everybody. Got some Star Wars games. Oh, uh, not too bad. Uh, I know I'm gonna get this, but I'm just kind of browsing the Funko collection. And don't forget the ten inches are all on the top. I'm out of the Funko gang because I ain't got enough room. Right? <laughs> Build a bigger house. I'm not out. <laughs> I'm not no, I'm Build completely out. Cave. I told him to get one of those storage sheds and get rid of them. There you go. You get rid of all your other Funko ones. heaven. No, I've literally got them just sitting all over my house. Oh. So oh, I'm, 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 I'm done. Oh, gotcha. Like <laughs> done, like they sold them all and then you're out. I mean, I will pick up the odd one every now and again, but other than that, I'm I'm done. Which here's the grill wall right here, and I actually have that, and uh, <laughs> which one? The Punisher. The Killua. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so many of those, not that many. <laughs> Actually, not bad prices either. No, not at all. But like I said, yeah. Yeah, but like I say, I'm out of the Funko game. <laughs> it's all about wrestling figures. It's hard to get out once you're in. Yeah. You're in. <laughs> <laughs> so we just left the con, had a blast. Spent a lot of money. You spent a lot of money. <laughs> Who spent money? Everybody but old man Pop. That's right. Because he's smart. That's right. So we're going to go find some more targets and then hit C4, uh, eat it tilted kilt, and head on home. So uh, we'll see you whenever Target. <laughs> All right. Oh. Okay. Okay. I got some AEW figures. Okay. Okay. We're gonna pick up Roy. Definitely gonna pick up Roy. Yeah. Ultimate Warrior. I got the uh, AJ Styles and Roman Reigns back here behind me. Good catch. Good catch. The Razor. Not the. Chase. Yeah. Oh, right. Uh, Razor Simone. Yeah. Maybe not the chase. Not the chase. Not the chase. Bye. No chases with the uh, with the head with the head shrinkers. But we are going to pick up a ray. You didn't want Becky? No. Uh, it, was, it looks like Ray and Becky's the only ones they got. Yeah! I want this one too. These are my Still got to see Tana because they're like first two waves. Don't nobody, don't nobody want them. It's $3. There you go, but bad card. Yeah, oh. that's, the, that's the only bad thing about it. And plus, those things are like $17. So. The Masters of the Universe. Masters. Got some Masters, got some Star Wars, Indiana Jones. Masterverse, some turtles. But all in all, successful at this target.
come around here to this aisle. We got some some Fortnite figures. Super Mario Bros. movie figs. Some Pokemon cards and such. Did you just pick up Big Mario? Yes. For Sam. Yes, he's got to get that for Sam. My daughter loves the Mario movie. I just got her the, the Peach. Peach. I see Sam has this. I'll put out right here. That. that. All right. That. Well, we... That. Got what we want. We're gonna see y'all over here at the Funko Nickel section. All right, here we over here at the Funko Nickel section, and doesn't look like too much. Uh, we have a black and white Robin from Batman '66. Um, Universal Monsters. Hooper for from Jaws. Okay, Herman Monster. Let's get a good look at Herman. Actually, not bad looking. Got some Justice League stuff, Target exclusives, and that's really about it. Um. Yeah, that's really about it, but we're going to walk out of here with a uh, Series 100 Rey Mysterio, and we'll see y'all at the next stop. Here we are at the new Totally Rad Toy House location. Some Ninja Turtles. When did y'all move to this location? We've been here for two months now. Two months? Yes, sir. Okay. And it's better. <laughs> it, it is. It's a little bit. It's a little bit more spacious. It is. Have you already been to the convention today, or are you going yeah. later? Okay, yeah, we just came from it. Figures, wrestling figures. All day out of it. Man, I killed me to go over there today, but obviously I'm here, so. Yeah, yeah. Got a Xavier Woods Chase. Oh, you were in this uh, after season 12, but I, I saw the door open and I didn't know what was happening. Jeff Norris, I'm like, 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 I'm
we will see y'all at the next stop. All right, we have made it to our final stop of the day, C4. And y'all already know where I'm headed to. Yeah! And there's a Luger Chase. There's a Bret Hart. There's a Bobby. Yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we, I always oh, wondered why, like, why didn't you just call him to begin with? And this movie would have been two hours and everything. <laughs> <set. laughs> I was wondering why it took three from, like, movies for us to well, like, I kind of go by, you yeah, know. Yeah, just yet back at home. Yeah. Uh, when I get out in a few months, or not even like a few weeks, I'm going back at home to my mom's house. And that's another thing I'm trying to get different things out, you know. All right. Seeing what they got in here. And seeing what I don't have. And, and that's okay. All right. All right. Look like some decisions have been made. Um. First off. Never mind. I thought it would be less, but it's not. Uh, let's see. There's a series 25 Sheamus. There's a Hogan. Um, there's a 96 Hulks Hogan. Here's a 101 Ricochet. All right, we're going to pick up this Bret Hart. Yeah! And, um... I mean, I'm definitely going to pick up something else, but we're going to start off with this Bret Hart. What you, what you looking for, old man pops? What you looking for? Switch games. Switch games for his son. There's a 102 Sammy. There's a 102 Edge. Yeah, that would be awesome. Um, it was 60 bucks. They're, they're only sold three of them. Did you see them? Yeah. Where is it? Uh, I think. Well, you just want to give me a few prices. Huh? We're going to pick up. Want to see these paintings? What you get? I got it. Hey, how's it going today? This Commissioner Foley. Definitely got to pick that up. Yeah! Everybody wants him to play Dark Brett. But so then we got this. I got this. Uh, venom. Uh, not Venom. It's Dope. And uh, then I also got and these ones in between. Yeah, these are I may. Okay. So uh, it's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Keep browsing through these other what? figures and stuff. Okay. And, and, big, and then they had a Miles Morales. Backpack and but I'm definitely going to keep looking like but versus, uh, we gotta see what Alex is so like Alex what you think what you, what you think of C4 I, I already picked something up and put it back down yeah, I'll you, pick it back up again yeah cause if you pick it back up the second time you gotta buy it mm. that's the rule these, these Ghostbuster figures got messed up too <laughs> Mm. Why did you bring me here? Because you, you said you want to spend some money, so here you go. No, I said I didn't want to spend any money. Well, you're going to spend some more. Yeah. I'm spending some more. Uh, I'm going to keep looking around, and if I find something else, I will let y'all know. He's found the Funko wall. If I do, I'll let you know. I have. I have. I'm still in the Funko game. Yeah. You know, I haven't retired like you. Yeah.
yes I'm out it's only certain if it's not a wrestler or a uh, a hip-hop artist I don't buy them Here's a Triple H and Ronda two pack. <laughs> like over here, we got some Rangers. My Hero, Seven Deadly Sins, Avatar, Dragon Ball. You alright? Hmm? <laughs> oh, that's nice. That is nice. That looks like a backpack. That looks like almost like a skateboard. I'd say it's probably pretty close to a chair. Yeah! This is something else I found, so I'm definitely picking it up. Rest in peace, Superstar Billy Graham. Yeah. It looks like I'm done in here. <laughs> yeah. You said it already. You said it. I had three three figures in a minute, and I, there you go. <laughs> I said two or three. <laughs> two or three. <laughs> Later that same evening. Let's see. I've been up since five o'clock, but let me describe my day in one word. <laughs> Sensational. So let's get to the reviews. Didn't stay at the con very long, but I stayed there long enough because I got to meet one of my, somebody I grew up watching in, in the wrestling and uh, he was just so nice. Got this bad boy signed. Got my Sergeant Slaughter Series 89 signed today. Mission accomplished. Uh, I actually have a photo of this up on my Instagram, but I had to share it with you guys. Like, what? And experience uh, I was a kid in a candy store but I did get like five minutes along with Sergeant Slaughter and I talked to him about uh, his hill turn in 1990 and uh, we just had a really cool conversation it was it was pleasant and uh, he's one of the nicest people I've ever met like I've met Adam Cole I've met Maria I've met uh, Jay Lethal I've met Kyle O'Reilly and Bobby Fish, but Sergeant Slaughter, top of the list, top notch guy. And uh, yes, if you ever have the opportunity to meet Sergeant Slaughter, I highly suggest it. Then, after we left the con, because we were there for about, about two and a half, three hours, we had to go find a target because that's what we do. And I was able to find from Series 100. The WCW Cruiserweight Champion Ray Mysterio Jr. Now this look was inspired from looks like Bash at the Beach '98. I have to go back and look, but that's what the look is inspired by. Series 100 has like a really really dope way. I gotta find that stunning Steve Austin and maybe the Andre the Giant Chase, but this was first on this and it's a cool figure. Um, I know there are a lot of Rey Mysterios, but there aren't enough WCW Rey Mysterios, so this was an absolute must for me. I had to get it. If you see it in Target, make sure you pick it up. And then uh, coming back home, stopped at uh, C4 because 
anytime we're near Fort Campbell, Clarksville, we always stop there. Great environment, love the people. Had to pick up three figures while I was in there. First, uh, we have this. It's from the Best of Class Superstars line. Um, we got this Red Hitman Heart with the. It's the Rome Intercontinental Championship, but it's still a cool figure. Like I said, I'm always in my my, uh, my class of superstars bag, but this was a bus get for me. It wasn't a bad price, it was only like 35. But yeah, had to get Brett to hit man hard. Best there is, best there was, best there ever will be. Solid pickup. Then from series 102, because 102 is not even in stores yet. So huge shout out to C4. Let's get out of this wave. Commissioner Foley. Uh, insert cheap pop somewhere in here. Yeah! Cool figure. Um, actually, kind of did not expect a Commissioner Foley figure, but I had to get it. And um, I seen most of this wave in. C4 except for uh, Gunther. Gunther was the only one that we did. I didn't see in there. If he if he wasn't there, I probably wouldn't have got this. I probably would have got Gunther. But 102, Big Foley, Commissioner. Uh, underrated role that he did during like the, the Attitude Era. Loved it. That's when he had his haircut and everything else. We were just weird and um, if you look closely at the at the head scan he's got like the small ear I don't know if I can put it on camera but yeah definitely dope and last but not least also from the classic superstars wave uh, it's a limited one in 3000 and this person recently passed away so we got the limited edition black and white superstar Billy Graham first off rest in peace Billy Graham trailblazer in the industry um, if you weren't for Billy Graham you probably wouldn't have a little just putting that out there but again dope 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 pick up had to get this um, I already have the uh first in the line elite but to have this is really really special again rest in peace to the late great superstar Billy Graham. so here's a quick recap of everything we got out of my own personal collection we got the autograph of Sergeant Slaughter we got the series 100 Ray Mysterio we got the uh, best of class superstars edition Bret Hart with the Intercontinental title. We got uh, Series 102, Commissioner Foley. And last but not least, Limited, Limited Edition 1 in 3000, first ever black and white Superstar Billy Graham. Again, rest in peace, great one, the Hall of Famer. Uh, all in all, a great day, great experience. Uh, shout out to Alex, we knew we had to get you out of the house one, one day or another. Like, we've been at this plan for probably like a couple of months, and it was cool just to hang out with him. Uh, you know, it was just a fun day, all around a fun day, and uh, I, I, I couldn't have it. I, I wouldn't have it any other way. Uh, yeah, we back. And we back, and we back, and we back. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Hunts are getting ready to to ramp up on the channel, getting getting in that uh, that early portion of the summer. Hopefully, a lot of figures will be hitting stores, and I'll be able to get those, show you those hunts and this, that, and the other. But um, yeah, um, that's all I can say. It's just it was just a fantastic day. Again, if you are new and you love wrestling figures and like what I do, go ahead super kick that subscribe button. Be sure to like, comment, and share that bell notification for upcoming content. 
And as always, remember to be blessed. Because your fellow man, stay safe out there and try to find happiness in this crazy world. I'll see you on the next one.